In order to help attract new recruits and present the CIA in a more personable light, we're proposing the creation of an online multiplayer computer and video game. The CIA already uses video games internally to train agents. And with the ever-growing popularity of video games, the CIA can use a video game to attract younger talent to the agency, as well as actively recruit from the pool of players a game creates. By drawing on the CIA's extensive knowledge, we can create the most accurate espionage game. A mystery and problem solving game that balances the strategy of Rainbow Six with the stealth gameplay of Splinter Cell. The game consists of an offline campaign mode as well as a multiplayer mode with potential for cooperative play. In campaign mode, players choose an international intelligence agency to direct. The player is given a goal and briefing materials. From the briefing materials, the player then devises a strategy and decides where to send each of his or her agents and what missions to have them complete. The player then controls each of his or her agents during the missions. In multiplayer mode, players enter into an online mission. This mission takes place in a virtual city populated with computer-controlled citizens. Several other players are completing missions within the same world at the same time. Players' missions overlap and conflict with one another. For example, Player 1's mission could be to assassinate another spy without being tailed. Meanwhile, Player 2's mission could be to tail Player 1 and find out who they are supposed to assassinate. This way, players must utilize real spy techniques to move through the city without being detected by other spies. The flexible online multiplayer platform allows for missions requiring cooperation among multiple spies. It also creates the potential for double agents and defectors, adding a whole new layer of realism. The CIA's inherent cool factor translates into an inherently cool video game. The marketplace is saturated with games trying to outshoot each other. This leaves plenty of room for a game focused on outsmarting your enemies.